quick before, before we talk about battle rap. You're younger than me. You're younger than me. So let me let me ask the young man's perspective right quick. I got 50 being winning the verses. You say what? I don't know. Sir? I think it's crazy that, um, you know, you. I think Wayne lasted for more generations than 50. So you get a, you get a lot of the young boys and, Agreed. you know, who, who will comment on Wayne and then be able to go back and listen to his stuff. Niggas know 50 for being a producer and, and, and a troll nowadays. So you had to be outside to know the imp Like, I don't know if respectfully, and I, I mean, I love Wheezy, love Wayne. I, I just can't find an Me album too. that matches Get Rich or Die Trying. Not one. Not one, in my opinion. And, you know. Go, 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 go. 50 just was, was way more. There was it was way, way more culture. It was way more like Wayne changed the game. You know what I mean? Like Fifty came in and filled the Tupac void almost, like in the early two thousands, and to a certain degree. Um, and you know to be to, to get on Interscope the way Eminem was running that shit, and to be able to you know become a star under you know under that that umbrella. It's impressive. It's, it's impressive. But you know, let me. Let me but see what, you feel me on this. Say, I say this all the time. Well, Y'all gotta got... stop acting like the massacre wasn't a great album. Like that, uh, that bothers me. And and I, 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 I now I understand. Finish your food, Frozen. Finish your food. Up against one of the best albums of all time, which is Get Rich or Die Trying. So it's hard to match that. But miss me with the one album shit. He had two classics and he had one all timer. So. I would say this: What Fifty has over Biggie, Jay Z, and Nas is this. In 0203, I thought Fifty was the first New York rapper that the South, the Midwest, and the West right. Coast embraced right. when mm -hmm. it came out. And that, when Gary and, that track came I, out, I'll take it a step further. You got to understand. I mean, you know, this is where Wayne got him. Wayne can get on somebody else's song and make it his. You know what I mean? Like Wayne's arguably the feature king. And there's a couple of dudes you could argue with him. He had yeah. pros. Can we agree yeah. that Wayne got that over fifty? though? Know? he got featured over fifty on your track. Far. Didn't make it by far. Wayne, it's the hit. You... Whoa, 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 whoa! No, 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 game no, no, was the no, documentary, no. sir. Relax. Yeah, game. Game. If if you want to be technical, the documentary, all the hits were fifties throwaways from the massacre. So a lot of people don't know that. Yeah, you know, I'm tapped in two, two, three. You ain't talking to nobody who don't know his shit. <laughs> okay, okay, finish your food. Finish your food. Growing up, I, I loved, I loved M. So I was tapped in the Interscope and Shady Aftermath. So G Unit, Banks, even when Game came along, you know what I mean. Ob Trice, you know what I mean. I hold that whole scene. You know what I mean. I definitely was tapped into that. But the piggyback, what you said though, what could get a little? I don't want to say dark. Wayne's feature yeah. bag is Yeah, first ballot Hall of Famer. First ballot Hall of Famer. Wayne was a bad dude with them features. Yeah, it's feature bag is Woo, yes, sir. All right, brother. Last time I spoke to you, you told me the next battle is going to yeah. be the biggest battle of your career. You uh, still feel that way? Yeah. Yeah, I do. I do. I feel like I, I feel. You don't well, sound no, sure, though, sir, but continue. The, the, the re-asking the question after, you know, updated resumes and shit. Um, you know, here's the problem with, with, with Clips and when he has a bad performance. Because I'm a fan of Clips. It's like, I think everybody is. You know, when he... Of course. When he, course, just, of he, was, course. he was only joking. I want to believe him. You know, like, just from being a fan of Charlie, you know, I want to believe him. Um, and then I guess, you know, I guess... That's a, we're looking at Kings versus Queens like an all-star game, almost like double impact now. I guess you can take that excuse that he gave. Um, but he's still Charlie, and, and I still think that, um, like, how long ago was him versus Lou Castro? That was recent. That was, that's four, four or five battles ago. Recent in, like, the last year. I mean, Clips didn't just fall off a cliff in five months. I think Clips' problem is he's lazy. Um and, you know, it's that simple. Um, kind of hurt the roll off of this battle a little bit. I'm glad that he um, doubled back and made some promises. Oh, I'm going to write this time and 
you know, my next opponent is going to suffer, all that cool shit, you know what I'm saying? So hopefully, hopefully, um, <laughs> hopefully he sticks to that, like, he keeps his word. I saw your tweets. Well, they were coming at a fast rate when Charles and Jackson was battling you. You said, and I quote, this clip is the version of Michael Vick yeah. playing for this. Yeah, Damn. I was a little high when I wrote them tweets. Uh, I heard that they got back to Charlie, uh, even though he's not on Twitter. I did hear they got to him. Uh, you know, sometimes, sometimes I do wish I keep my opinions to myself. Um... <laughs> <laughs> you know, but um, I'm an outspoken person uh, about things that I'm passionate about. You know, I'm passionate about battle rap, uh, and you know, I wasn't I wasn't just watching Charlie's last battle from a competitive standpoint. I was watching it from you know the guy's standpoint, Kings versus Queens. I'm on the guy side, obviously, right? Right. So I wanted right. us to win. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I wanted the guys to win for battle rap, and you know, I just thought clips kind of laid an egg, and um. You know, I, I was vocal about it, uh, but you know, supposedly he didn't like what I had to say. Good, good, good. You know, I had him losing his last three. Did you watch Cal, Jazz, yeah. and Danny? Were you able to watch yeah. any of those um, battles? The thing about clips is, for them last three battles, uh, uh, you know, it, it's if you're scaling off your last three, well, he, lo he looks like he's been struggling, but I know better though. You know, you got to understand, when you're in the Mount Rushmore conversations, which he, he has been for a long time, um, those guys, you like to think they have an ability to turn it on and turn it off. Um, everybody doesn't have that ability. Just just hit this. I'm going to cut your wisdom off. Hey, this boss, well, is he really still so, Mount Rushmore candidate? Let me ask you a question. And I'm not try, trying to over equivalent this to what Clips is doing. But did, did, did Michael Jordan's years with the Wizards hurt his resume? Okay, he still was Mike, and we still no, love it him. Hurt his I think resume. we gotta be. No. It's not like clip. Right, right, right. You know, so I think. Okay, that, I think we um, go with that. Okay. Once you hit a certain milestone of stats, it's kind of hard to be taken out of that conversation. Now, is he a shoe in? No. I think that's might would have changed. Clips being a shoe in for it, but worthy being a candidate? Sure, it's Miss Charlie. I mean, yeah, of course. He's done plenty. If he stopped the day, he's a candidate. Um, but, you know, it's just hard to judge those last three battles because, again, I don't find that as him being washed up or over the hill. It's just more laziness, in my opinion. So, you know, it, it, that's fixable. Being lazy is fixable. So, you know, I still got a lot of respect for, you know, the possibility of the ability – to, you know, hit that switch and, and beat the clips that we all know. But I think I can beat that clips too. So, you know, it's not really it's not really necessarily it doesn't make a oh. difference to me. It's almost like his clips gonna lay down and let me fuck him up and then let the narrative be clips didn't care. Cause cause that's an easy he's smart enough to know that. Well I can go in here and wing it. And they'll just say I didn't care about Frozenberg. So, you know, it, it could be that or you know it could be, you know, fully equipped clips. But I think I could beat him. And, and and either either uh either way. Is is he one of the battle rappers that you look at as a competitor and you look at Charlie's resume and is is what he's done for battle rap in the sense of that do you think he cheated do you think he cheated himself and did he have potential to be the yeah, greatest dude that ever did this ever? Um but you know, um I think wait, ask that question again so I'll make sure I answer it right. You know what I'm saying? Do you think he had the potential he's to be one the greatest, of the greatest ever? Ever. I mean, you know, Julius Irvin is, but he's not the greatest ever. Um, but he's one of them. I feel like Clips always comes right in under your, your God tier guys. Like, you know, all the all the super duper type talented guys. Clips is in, you know, the same. He's better than most of them. And there's some that he's not better than. Um, but, you know, at, at, it's, it's Clips. I, I don't know. Uh, I, Clips is an all time. I'm go, and that's that's basically what it is. I don't think that's going to change by bad performance at the bad performance. I just think you know he's hurting how we look at him in 2023. But again, one good performance changes all that. It's what have you done for? It's what have you done? It's what have you yeah. done for me lately? So yeah. let's say he goes and bombs and has a crazy performance at RBE, everything's forgiven. That's kind of how it works. You saw his blog yesterday, or whenever he dropped it, a couple of days now. What was the first? What was your initial reaction when you saw his blog? He was offended. 
Do you like Mook ain't no yeah, those, MJ. You, like the fact you don't know the sport if you're saying Mook ain't no MJ. You haven't been around to even know what you're talking about. And I know who you <laughs> is, Charm. You, you have no clue what you're talking about. I promise you, you have no clue. Um, <laughs> would, you, would you say uh, No, I was going to throw it off the studio. What did I say? Um, no, him with Charm, your freestyles. Oh, um, the freestyles. What was your initial? You said, you said, are you glad you annoyed him? Are you glad you offended him? It's part of me. I, I, I don't care. Yeah, I don't care. I'm, a, I'm an ultra competitor. So, mm. like, you know, I, I like going and reading comments that disrespect him. You know what I mean? That's that's a thing that gets me going personally. You know what I mean? A little secret that I didn't have to tell y'all. But I'll mm. go. Uh, he posted something on Instagram today about me. Um, I, it was funny. But that didn't bother me. I, I start going through the comments. Oh, Clips, this is an easy one. Clips this easy work. I like that. That shit gets me. That you know that shit gets me going. Um, I, I could care less if Clips wants to freestyle or play around. Clips is a jokey, jokey dude, and when he when he is serious, right? I don't buy it. So it's like you know, at the end of the day, you know, I think believability matters too. Uh, you know, and everybody likes to have predictions on what's going to happen before um before the, the battle. But at the end of the day, it's like when we get there, we'll see. I usually, you know, I, I usually have a habit of making right. moves look like not how they usually look. You know what I mean? And I think, you know, we like to sw sweep that under the rug. I do that often. You know what I mean? You guys look at a guy a certain way, and I, I make him look not like that. That's a skill. You know what I mean? I don't think Charlie <clears throat> above having that attitude. It, people are saying now, Froze, that since he did that blog, that he's telling the coach now he's gonna be on hundred, no freestyles or written raps. Now some people are saying he's gonna beat you down the street. He's smart. That. You say what's that? He knows that it doesn't take much to get his fans to buy back into his shit. So <laughs> Charlie's smart. <laughs> For Charlie real. Knows he's got a cult following, and uh, all he needed to do was put that out there, and, and at least half was gonna buy it. Um, I hope I hope that's how he. You know, I hope he doesn't put an asterisk next to the battle. You know what I mean? Um, you know, it, 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 it's. You know, I, I here's the thing. I think he'd rather say that than to say he respects me. I think he he think he say that than rather say mm. oh, I'm a little nervous about this Rosenberg matchup. He on fire. He been fucking shit up. You know what I mean? He's not gonna say that. You know what I mean? So what's the easy thing to do? Well, I ain't gonna freestyle this battle. Sometimes I don't even know if he freestyles. I think he chokes and goes into the freestyles. I don't think he doesn't write. I think sometimes he doesn't rehearse enough. Choke, miss. Is his round misses a part of his round and then relies on the freestyle. So Cubs freestyle always hits mm. bombing. You know he could be in the middle of something, somebody interrupting. Yes, yeah. you know he go right into it and land the haymaker. That's usually when he's prepared. But you can kind of tell when he's not prepared because the quality of the freestyle goes down. We be disappointed if he had a battle like that, like, 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 like jazz. Yeah. I wouldn't be upset. He's gonna, he's gonna, he's gonna get, he's gonna get done bad if he comes in there and does that shit he did with Jazz. I don't, you know, I don't buy into the ranking system. I'm better than a lot of people that people have ranked above me. So like, you asked 100 people, 98 of them would have clips ranked above me. You know what I'm saying? You can't, you you, you <clears throat> couldn't convince me that clips could beat me though. So it's like, you know, the ranking system is for the fans, and you know they have their opinions and. You know, but but for me and the people in my circle and, you know, what makes up Rosenberg, it's not a doubt in my mind that I'm going to dog Charlie respectfully. You know what I mean? It's, yeah, but that's you know, dog a, Charlie? a lack of respect for Charlie. That's more confidence in what I do. Rose, Rose, what do you mean? That's not a disrespect for Charlie. Yeah, no, but I, I wanted to you say it's not like this because Charlie's not good. I believe I'm going to put put together uh, a three rounds that is going to get the job done. All right, let's have some conversation right quick. Would you agree stop that this man, man, for whatever reason, stop it, nigga. people are still say... Nothing. I'm arguably 15-0 and 0 in my last 15 battles, and if you want to give me any losses, it's 13-2, and 14-1. And, and I don't have to stop nothing. I have to stop nothing. That's the problem. Y'all get these comments and start thinking what y'all niggas say matter. I don't have to stop nothing, nigga. I want, listen, I'm snapshotting you. When I fuck Charlie up, I want you to come back and apologize and buy and see what they do for views of you. That's what you do. That's what you do. Y'all always say, oh, stop. You're not walking Charlie. You probably said that about Ill Will. You probably said that about A Ward. And then you sat there looking stupid as I was doing it. You know what I mean? Yeah, I'm, I'm, 
Y- y'all annoy me with that shit. What the fuck are you talking about? I like that. You, I, like, I like niggas. Nigga, you look tight, though, bro. Y'all, y'all, I'm not going to lie to you. what Charlie just did. You know what I mean? Hold on. Let me try to get my shit right. I got my shit right. Die on me. Oh. All right, all right. All right, you all right. Wow. Bro, right. you better stop. You know, you know, we will revisit this. You know why? Because Froze... Froze can stand on a loss. You know how many how many ass whoopings I've given out? You know how many W's I've burned? You know how many niggas walking around with a Frozenberg L on their fucking forehead? and gotta watch the way they talk to me because they know what I did to them in the ring. I, so I'm not. I didn't whoop so much ass. A loss don't change me. Look at the level we talking about. We gotta go get Charlie to get an L. That's that's a compliment to me, nigga. That ain't a knock. So if I lose. To Charlie, I'll sit here with the same energy and let you know. Hats on, Charlie was the better man. I just haven't been able to say that in a few years. So excuse me if I got if I'm getting used to winning. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I expect to win every time I get in the ring, no matter if it's fucking Charlie or Jack. I expect to win the battle. I don't know if you know that, but anytime I'm in the ring, no matter what name it is, I expect to win every time. Yeah. So. I told I, I'm you know I said that shit when IP was you know are, he asked me if was I worried about ill will and it's not a human being in battle rap that I'm worried about it's not a battler you can say that I'd be worried about mm-hmm. getting in the ring like you know what I'm saying so give a fuck to this clip I say since Craig Lamar you ever turn from Craig Lamar I don't know if people have paid attention to the scoreboard but since the Craig Lamar battle yeah, you've been on a hell run since you since you've been back stop, full time right. maybe you. Maybe, Listen, maybe maybe yeah, maybe, maybe you should stop. Talk a lot of shit, man. Maybe you should stop denying what you really feel. Damn, wrong a dog. It's cool, bro. Accept it. It's real. It's real. I'm really like that. I, I you know, I love, love when I read the comments and they be like, "Yo, man, they be gassing raw for the most for the most basic shit." You know, it's actually a skill. It's called relatability. You know, they're, they're able to digest the bars mm. I get because they're relatable. Don't matter what city you from, what mm. part of the map you from, you 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 can relate to the, the formula I use. That's the part people miss. They call it simplicity. No, it's relatability, dickheads. It's a difference. It's a difference. Mm. And, I, and you know, I, three. I know what works for me. You know what I'm saying? Like I know. Hold on. Right. I know what works right. for me. Right. So it's almost like it's almost like. Oh my bad. It's almost like I know good, good. for a fact niggas can't guard me going left. You know what I mean? I know you can't guard me going left. So until you stop mm-hmm. me from going left, I'm going left every time. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> if it, if, 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 if that's what they be trying to do to me. Bro, so don't only use his right hand. We'll stop it. Why well, I'm still dropping 30 with my right. You know what I mean? So, so I don't know. I got a lot of respect for Charlie, but it's nobody that, you, including Charlie, that I feel like I can't figure out how to win in a, in a battle. You know what I'm saying? So, you know. Is, no, that, is it hard to prepare not. for Charlie? Absolutely. No, for what? Why would it be hard to, really? to, 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 to talk to Charlie? I mean, you got to understand. I mean, he's got a portfolio. It's a lot to go off of. You know what I mean? I mean, it's current events mm-hmm. shit you can go off of. It's easy to go in there and talk about what everybody else talks about. Right. But you know, I don't. But you, but you know, I don't do that. You know, you right, know, I right. That. I I right. Opponent, and, and I got my own unique way of doing it. You know what I mean? I got my own unique way of doing it. You know what I mean? You know, I see a lot of times people go into battles with Charlie, and Charlie can make you his friend by the second round. He's nudging your shoulder. You guys are giggling together in between bar. I'm not Charlie's friend, and I don't want to be. I don't dislike him. I don't have no problem. I met Charlie a few. Jazz fell for the shenanigans, bro. So, she fell know, for the I shenanigans. No I told you that. Being friends with Charlie while we're battling, I have no interest in him liking my bars or thinking they're dope. I don't give a fuck about none of that. Like I'm trying to really, I'm trying to really make a, a statement against clips. You know what I'm saying? I'm kind of trying to make a statement mm. against clips, and I hope he tries because then it'd, it'd be more sad as it'd be I, it'd be more satisfying getting a W when he's trying to win. What kind of statement you gonna um, make, bro? I'm of that cloth. I'm of that cloth. I'm, I'm a top, mm. top twenty, top fifteen, top ten battler in the world. I can beat anybody. You know that's the kind of statement that I'm trying to make. Um, mm. You know we like to move the needles for the guys we don't like as much as the other guys. You know what I mean? So you know if it's a, mm. if it's a guy who's a real, real fan, fan favorite, 
you know, we get to move the needle for him. But, you know, the other guys got to, you know, they got to stay and, and do extra reps and do extra shit that you don't hold other dudes to the, you know, so I'm aware of all that. You know what I mean? Um, So, you know, I'm frozen, man. You already know what it is. What? What's a win for what's another a win against win, Charlie? Another for win you? under the under the belt. I've been racking them up lately. You know, another big win, another uh, milestone, uh, another you know notch up to my career. There's no ceiling on where I'm trying to take it. You know what I'm saying? So, Crookman, what up, gang? It's no ceiling. Um, you know, not only mm. do I want to be looked at as the best in RBE, you know, I want to be looked at as one of the best in the world in general. Um, best in RBE was never enough mm. for me. You know what I mean? Feel like I'm better than right, right, anybody right, right. on any platform, right. and you know you gotta have that. It, it gotta have some ignorance in this sport. You know what I mean? To be a fighter, to be a one-on-one -on -one sport guy, you gotta have some. Yeah, you gotta be wired that way, right? You gotta be wired. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. I, if I was sitting here telling you, man, I got an uphill battle to figure out how I'm battling Charlie, I'm down one up. You know what I mean? So you, you gotta kind of mm. normalize this shit, and and you know not you know act like this is some super huge battle. It's another day at the office for Frozenberg. If anybody got anything to prove, it's Clips. What do I got to prove? Mm. I, you know, I feel you, but I still feel people are still, because Charlie's, let's think about this. Charlie still gets, he, he loses in public, right? But the fans, the app, for instance, I thought Danny Wise clearly won the battle, right? But the app gave him the win, right? And it's still Charlie Clips at the end of the day, because now you got people saying now, Rose, before the before he did his Instagram live, it was okay, we all got froze. Now he's like, I'm not gonna freestyle. I'm gonna come in there prepared. I'm gonna come now. People are switching up the narrative now. Oh, this battle Somebody be close. Charlie, or Charlie's gonna win. Um yeah. He's gonna uh, fight. Yeah, that's not a that's um, not a no that's a no brainer. You know, yeah. you know <clears throat> when I say Charlie got something to prove, I mean nobody's questioning if I care. Nobody's questioning if I'm a fight, and nobody's <laughs> questioning if I'm a try, right? We don't even know if Clips are right. battling anymore. We don't know. We don't know. Those are the questions you guys are asking, right? Wow. You know, and look, I mean, right, 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 people right, say right, he's right. still in a freestyle. So, you know, it, it really, when I say Clips got something to prove, it doesn't mean that his legacy is in, in question. That's intact. Currently, where we're at in 2023, we don't know where it's at, so you know um, that's what he got to prove. Okay, Jack what's up, you Jack Boy, man? 